Iraqi protesters stormed parliament against PM nominee. Hundreds of angry protesters, loyal to the powerful cleric Mutada Ansad, broke into Baghdad's heavily protected green zone on Wednesday, denouncing the nomination of a new prime minister. Mohammed Shia Ansudani was formally nominated to lead the country on Monday by the Coordination Framework, the largest Shiite alliance in the Iraqi parliament. His nomination followed the mass resignation of Ansad's parliamentary bloc, a group of over 70 lawmakers who withdrew from the governing body last month in an apparent show of force after months of political stalemate. Iraq has struggled to form a new government since parliamentary elections in October. Saad's own attempts to form a government have previously foundered amid opposition from rival blocs. If the Saadrist bloc remaining in parliament is an obstacle to government formation, then all lawmakers of the bloc, then all lawmakers of the bloc are honorably ready to resign from parliament, Saad said. The cleric who positions himself as against both Iran and the United States is immensely popular. His bloc's success in the October vote threatened to sideline Iran-aligned Shiite blocs that have long dominated the oil-rich country's politics. On Wednesday, Ansad told protesters at on Wednesday, Ansad told protesters at the Parliament building that their message had been received and that they should return home. A revelation of reform and rejection of injustice and corruption. Your message has been received. You have terrified the corrupt. Pray and return home safely, he said. The outgoing government of Prime Minister Mustafa Ankatimi also issued a statement calling on the Sadrist protesters to immediately withdraw from the green zone, preserve public and private properties, and to abide by the instructions of the security forces. That's it for today. Thank you and goodbye.